Hi. Before I explain to you about this beautiful generator that I built, uh, let me show you first how I built this alternator and then we are going to run the machine, okay? Well, now that you saw how I built the alternator with the neonatrium magnet inside, let's see how it works. So, the, all this concept works on two batteries. Two tiny batteries, you see? As you see, when I open the switch, nothing. There is nothing at all on this machine, like besides, as you see, you see, nothing at all. Now, the two batteries will charge. <coughs> I bought a new battery of uh, 10 amps hour, okay? This one. So the two batteries will run the alternator and the alternator will charge this big battery and we charge as well two spare battery as you see here that can replace those two batteries. We don't have to replace them because we have here a relay that make the job Okay, and we have a potentiometer, and everything works alone. We don't have to do nothing at all. Now, let me just show you how it works. Now, the bulb is working with on a small inverter inside here with the capacitor bank. So it's 100% uh, from the alternator. The charge is divided to two batteries here in between and the charge to the big one and the capacitor runs the small inverter that runs this bulb and as well we have a bulb here a spare bulb of 220 bulb that's coming from the two small batteries and the capacitor too so let's to see let's, let's run it first it's unbelievable that all now the most important thing is that it's difficult to you see the magnet tuck 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 you see the magnet are making the objection of the EMF so in, in, in order to spin it really look look at here the light look, look what we do okay I will show you something and we are going to see something right well you can see that the alternator look at the up you see the contact as usual but anyway let me show you Okay, you see, look, it's becoming stronger. So, to, in order to spin it very, very uh, light without meaning a, very simple and we're not always with objection, I'm using the power to run it from here, you understand? As much as you go far away from the center, it will be easier to spin the alternator, okay? So, let's try to do it. Uh, you see, there's nothing here, and we put the battery, and let's see what it gives. You see? Now, let's check the charge. Okay, look, a beautiful charge. So, we can, as well, as well, we can light the light as well from the cups in the small inverter that is here okay and you can see so we have two bolts as well and this is this is 100 percent from the alternator and the capacitor we are going to charge the battery now you see how it's going a little bit slower You see, you can hear the noise when it's charged, and you can see the number too, okay? Look at the number. You see, it's going up slowly, slowly. So what we have here, what we have here is that we have, we can use this battery 
with the DC converter that charge back the two primer batteries. And we have around 200% more energy that left over to run as well in another inverter with another bulb, you understand? So it can work for that for hours. Then I have a phone charger here of five volt. The charge from the 10 ampere battery back to the two point, uh, the 3.7 battery back, you understand? And then after one hour, you could the number and then it will be charging and charging more and more, you understand? Uh, this is a beautiful concept that works and can give you a, at least four bulb from this battery back uh, with another inverter. Or you can, phone your, you can charge your phone and it's really, really beautiful one. It's 100% uh, self-charging generator. Thank you very much. Bye.